Voxelnauts. Hello, Voxelnauts. We passed 1,000 subscribers this month. Thank you so much for your support over the past year since I started this channel. I've been considering doing some LEGO-related videos for a while, a bit different from my usual voxel art tutorials. But we enjoy all things block-related here, right? Here I have my small collection of LEGO brickheads, which is sort of LEGO's version of Funko Pop figures. I've never been interested in collectibles and figurines before, but I've always loved LEGO. These are fun little guys to build and often have very uncommon parts if I ever decide to take them apart and build something else. I pre-ordered this set a few months ago, expecting it to ship early August for my birthday, but it decided to arrive on July 20th. So here it is, set 75317, The Mandalorian and the Child, aka Baby Yoda. The box arrived, well, a bit squashed. Amazon decided to ship this in a bubble pack instead of a sturdy box, which apparently has been the case for most others reviewing this online. But as long as the bricks are fine, I don't save the boxes anyway. I just opened this to check that nothing was damaged inside. So even though The Mandalorian is marked as part two of this set, I know you're all here for Baby Yoda. You'll just have to wait a little bit to get to that part. Normally I'm the kind of Lego maniac who goes digging through a giant pile without much concern for organization, but I feel like that would be stressful to watch me digging through piles of parts, especially if you see the piece before I do. So let's do a magic cut to where all the parts are nicely lined up on my board. Ta-da! Having a camera aimed at my hands is still all new for me, but I think I'll get the hang of it. I recently snagged all my old collection from my parents' house, and now I enjoy building with my kids and collecting sets I missed out on when I was younger. Let me know in the comments if you like LEGO-related content, and I'll try to do some more videos about my growing collection. It's fun to see the cool snot constructions in Brickheads. Yes, I said snot. It stands for studs not on top. I wasn't sure what this hollow section was going to be, but it makes room for these two disconnected halves that make up the faceplate. Can't forget the brain. Every Brickheads figure has a brain block. They're not always pink, though. While we're just watching me build, I'd like to take a quick moment to thank the major sponsors who have funded every video ever made on this channel. Except this one. Even though I had the idea to start doing voxel art videos before I started working with the sandbox, their funding to start making tutorials for VoxEdit is what got this all started. Now I'm working as a staff member and living my childhood dream of being a game developer thanks to them. Besides the tutorials, I also do two weekly streams for the sandbox, showing the workflow between VoxEdit and the game maker. You can check out a playlist of my previous streams up here. Thank you also to my other major sponsor, VoxelMax, who is constantly releasing amazing new tools and features for voxel creation on Apple devices. Funding from VoxelMax got me through a good chunk of last year, when I wasn't sure if freelancing would continue to work out for me and my family. You can find the tutorials I made for VoxelMax on iPad in this playlist. I really like the way the cape is constructed on this. Brickheads usually have shapes like this for hair, and it's cool to see it used in a different way. With all of the accessories added, we can put the Mandalorian on his base and take a look at him. Okay, now the real reason you clicked on this video. Baby Yoda. Let's magically snap all these parts into rows. And, well, I'm sorry to disappoint you, but the instructions say that I have to do the pod first. So you're gonna have to wait a little bit longer. But hey, while you're watching, how about giving the video a thumbs up? And while you're down there at the bottom of the video player, don't forget to subscribe and ring the bell if you're not one of the awesome 1,029 people who have already done that.
next level. This pod build is actually really cool. It's got a nice egg shape to it. With these little decorative sides finished, now we can finally... Uh, wait. <laughs> we have to build the base first. Okay, I promise I'm done now. And look, he's got a little brain for his little head. Line those beady eyes up just right. His ears can be placed up or down to show different moods. I'm going with excited ears. And he's done. Time for a close up. You can order this set online for about $20 plus shipping. And I've heard that it's already on store shelves now too if you don't want to get a squished box like mine. Just be sure to be kind to those around you and wear a mask if you're still watching this in 2020. Thank you again for an amazing first year on YouTube and 1000 subs. And of course, thank you for watching.